good morning good morning everybody we are still in the mountains that's for sure just left Merritt there about 45 minutes ago and here we are going downhill downhill right now uh, when we leave Merritt we go uphill there for about 10 miles and now we're going downhill what goes up must come down right but uh, we'll be in uh, Kiam loops here pretty soon probably within the next 15 minutes uh, just on top of this hill we had a brake check so we just finished doing that and so here we are going downhill yeah it's quite a ways down so uh, enjoy the ride and uh, Hey, we'll be uh, probably in uh, for sure in Edmonton tonight or uh, I'm shooting for uh, the Alberta Saskatchewan border there but uh, I forget the name right now but Lloyd Minister that's what it's called uh, that's what I'm shooting for but we'll see we'll see how far that will be I only have 11 and a quarter hours for today at least that was my calculation this morning so we can't do uh, a full day's worth of driving up here in Canada, which is okay too, but uh, in the US it would be a full day worth of driving, but not up here in Canada. Up here in Canada we can drive 13 hours, right? So, but uh, yeah, so we'll keep on rolling, keep on rolling, and uh, we'll see you down the road. All right, here we are at our turn off, going into Cam Loops right now. Just going over to Highway 1 right now. And you can see a huge mount mountain in the background up there. I should have put the camera on the mirror there and give you a better angle, but hey, I didn't do that, so here we are. Now we have to just record it like this, I guess. <laughs>
just entered Alberta here a little bit ago and we are back to the snow coverage looks pretty good the roads are nice and dry the sun is out it's not really any wind up here at all so it's nice nice uh, I, I think this is as nice as it can get in winter time right now you know nice and sunny oh, what do we got here broke down truck or something Looks like, oh, this is the tow truck that passed me earlier. Yeah, so he came for this guy. All right, okay. Well, at least he's got help on the way, so he'll be able to get fixed up or get towed somewhere. But, hey, as I was saying, uh, it's as nice as you can have it in winter time. Sunshine and dry roads. Hey, what better could you ask for in winter, right? But, uh, yeah, we're making our way down uh, to Edmonton. I'll probably end up spending the night in Edmonton tonight. I already looked on uh, how many kilometers it is up to Lloyd Minister, and it's too far. I cannot make it there today with my hours. Technically, I could get there if I had the hours with the amount of kilometers it is. If I had a full day worth of hours to drive, I would have had no problem making it. But hey, I am limited to my hours, so hey, that's all right. We'll just go as far as we can. There isn't really that much between uh, Edmonton and Lloyd Minister, so I could probably go a little past Edmonton. But hey, since there isn't that much, we'll probably spend the night in Edmonton. But that's all right. Uh, dispatch said yesterday it uh, didn't really matter when I got there. Oh, well, looks like we got a helicopter up there. Reduced ahead. Up on the mountain there is probably checking up all the snow that's up there. But oh well. And uh, dispatch said it didn't matter when we get there. When we get there is when we get there. So oh well, uh, we'll try and get there as early as we can tomorrow morning. get there early and uh, if we do get there early enough then hopefully we can get ourselves a reload somewhere tomorrow and uh, start heading back because I really need to start heading back tomorrow that's for sure I mean I'm on my way towards Manitoba but all right we got ourselves a smoky bed up here let's give him some room slow her down take her easy Somebody was speeding. Oh well, that happens. I'm surprised he's out here in the middle of nowhere, but hey, <laughs> you never know where to expect these guys, right? Oh well, that's alright. Anyways, we'll keep on rolling, rolling, and make some money. Well, guess what? I am parked over here at the uh, little pullover area looks beautiful and beautiful and I got out and uh, I heard some noise and I look over and uh, I don't think you'll be able to see it up there but there's actually a helicopter up there he's got his uh, blades spinning I don't know what they're doing there must be uh, they must be uh, taking tourists up here uh, to the mountains to give him a good view or maybe perhaps skiing or something like that so yeah, so uh, any of this, uh, figure I just show you guys a little bit on what we're looking at over here. It's pretty cold up here, but hey, look at the beautiful mountains in the background up there, eh? Up there as well. Yeah, it's uh, beautiful scenery that we get to see up here, you know, and we get to enjoy when we drive truck, you know. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to go have me something to eat here. Probably go have me something. I got some stuff here in the truck. I'm gonna get me a bite to eat and continue on. I figure I just go for a little bit of a walk here and check my tires and everything, you know. So uh, yeah, so uh, down there we got a little bit of a river. I don't think you can see it from here, but uh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, yeah people are probably 
taking a walk down there sometimes, you know. Anyways, we'll get going here. Hey, good evening. I am back. I made it to a rest area just uh, east of Edmonton. Stopped there for the night, about 45 minutes uh, east of Edmonton. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cold up here, which is normal, I guess, for this time of the year, but oh well. Got about another four hours and 15 minutes tomorrow to go to our delivery place up here in Saskatchewan. And should have no problem making it up there, right? But uh, anyways, I'm uh, going to call it a day. And uh, So thanks for watching. We'll see you again tomorrow Friday. Night.